In life and in death, we give glory. Uh, hello? You shouldn't be out here. It's not safe. What the hell? Hey, can you hear me? Uh, it's you. The child's father. Child? Hey, wait. Do you mean Rose? Is she here? <laughs> Rose! Rose, yes. She is in great danger. Since Mother Miranda brought her to the village, we have fallen into darkness. What are you talking about? The monsters? I know there were soldiers defending on the roof. They had the radio. There might be supplies, too. All right. I'll lay down cover fire from there while you get our people to the sewers. If you're sure, sister, maybe you can reach the roof climbing up there. That should get you to the roof. I'll give you a boost. I'll find a good place to cover you. I know. You've always been a better shot than me. The Pasha is with me now. And I know he wouldn't want to... Like All right, gentlemen. This is it. Are we goddamn ready? Ready, ready Dutch. Good. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two, Hold position here. Let's go.
So, you took over that COV propaganda center all by your widow self? They have me outnumbered 20 to 1. Bad odds for them. I am impressed. <clears throat> oh man, the children of the vault totally trashed my camp. Like, that is not where that bloody skull should be. It is completely ruining the vibe. Oh, I know a shortcut. This way. Says Arasaka on the crate. We are robbing some heavy. You think you can make some money on it? Sure. Think it'll make us happy. Us? Yeah, partner. We'll go half seas. Any decent fixer will find a. I don't have any plans. Thanks, much appreciated. 